Tay and Nelms is readjusting to life without her 14-year-old cat, Dewey. He was more than just a pet to her. Ever since I've had him, I just loved him because he was the last thing I had of my godfather. And to think now that he's gone is, it's hard. Dewey was an indoor-outdoor cat, so his absence Thursday night didn't worry Nelms. Her concern began when he didn't come home. I went out and I searched for him from like 9 o'clock to almost 12 in the pouring rain. Friday morning around 9 a.m., Scraps got a call about a cat found in the street looking unwell. He looks sick. He looks sick? Yeah, he did something wrong. He can barely move. Scraps says Dewey was brought in just before 11 a.m. Scraps released a statement saying Dewey was, quote, actively dying on the exam table. Without a microchip, Scraps says it euthanized Dewey the same day to ease his suffering. Reports show Dewey suffered from kidney failure and severe dehydration. Dewey has been cremated, but Nelm says to properly begin healing, Scraps can begin with an apology.